Hello, and this is the little random Chaz. This is my first let's play of Tomb Raider. I've played it before, so I should do well. I hope you enjoy. Here is my brother <laughs> helping out as well in uh, the background. Yeah, I am Matt from Super Video Game Bros. If you don't know, check my channel out. We do four player co ops. Yes. <laughs> so what platform is this on, Charlotte? It's on PS3. Um, it's been my second playthrough, so I yeah, hope well, I'm we okay. Yeah, both played the game. It's really, really good. Yes, one of the best. I think it should be... Game of the year. Yes. <laughs> <Look at> that. <laughs> okay, so I guess... I'm just going to stop. <laughs> and I need to turn on the controller, for God's sake. <laughs> that might help. If you haven't played it, you should play it, because it's like pretty awesome. And also, I might add, if you were young, you shouldn't really be watching this. It's what, like 18? Yes, the there are so some scenes that wouldn't be appropriate for kids. A little bit kids. graphic. So if you're like 10 years old on YouTube, then you should like not be watching this if it's too graphic. I cannot remember where the subtitles are. <laughs> <laughs> there you go, subtitles there. But yeah, I'm basically helping, I'm just here to help out and support my sister for the first couple of episodes. If I won't be playing, I'll just be talking in the background. Yes, I was just starting out on a let's play. Yes, no, I wanted to start uh, out because I haven't done any, and I like playing games. I'm pretty cool. <laughs> okay. <That's> really cool. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> oh, because it's different, yeah. I was just like, what? Okay. <laughs> I will it. play on normal, she's but it may go back to easy. Well, this is the first thing that you extraordinary is in what we do, not who we are. I finally set out to make my mark, to find adventure, but instead, adventure found me. moments when life flashes before us we find something something that keeps us going something that pushes us Welcome back. <laughs> After watching that scene, how is Laura gonna fare? <laughs> so she goes on this island now after the ship being wrecked. Mm. Really cool, <laughs> oh, they're in yellow and blue, green. <laughs> Dead. <laughs> <laughs> That's good, Matt. But yeah, we won't we won't spoil the game for you guys since we've really played it. But yeah, we'll try not to. <laughs> no scary. spoilers. Spoilers and not any comments, either. Yes, because they will be deleted. <laughs> blocked. And blocked. This game is a very visual and aesthetic game. Mm. It's better than I thought it would be, because I thought because of the previous ones, because they started from the beginning again, that it would be a bit 
cheesy. Or... Yeah, or not as good because all the old ones are really good. Because like the yeah, the older ones were really good, and then after like I don't know five, I, don't, I can't remember. Mm. It didn't turn out that as good. And it didn't feel like a Lara Croft game, but now it seems like this one is. Mm. It's the start of her adventure. It's got a little bit of a kind of. Uncharted feel for it, which isn't a bad thing. But Uncharted got their feel from Tomb Raider. Yeah. Original. So far, it's <laughs> squiggling. I'm swinging to the side! Oh, that one's all down there. <laughs> It's funny, <laughs> Charlotte. She, Charlotte's swinging herself up back and forth with the character. What? Uh oh. No! Oh crap, that's button press. Oh no. It's... Oh, that would have hurt. When I first played this, that made me. I had to look away. Oh, that would hurt. Ow. Okay, I'm wounded and now I shall carry on. As she is, Laura Croft after all. Bloody hell. Oh god. Uh, oh my god. <laughs> but this game does remind me a little bit of um, Lost or Arrow, if anyone's watched that TV programme. I'm going that too much. Because, yeah. <laughs> I really like this game, it's so awesome. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but maybe in about, probably like the second episode I probably won't be here because I'm just like supporting my sister for the first time since the first time she's doing Let's Play so I might be in like random episodes now and again but yeah. But all we'll make sure to subscribe and support Charlotte. Let's Play because it'll probably kick up and be better later on as well. Yes. With all the action kicking up because this game does get into the action nearly like right away. Yes, it does. And I will be in the future do if I get more support, I will get make more let's plays with more an more content. Yes, and more <laughs> different. You can say more anime. I, I know I'm gonna say anime. <laughs> if anyone didn't know, I make AMVs. Please and anime free. And manga videos. No! Oh crap, sorry. I had it about that Quick! <laughs> <laughs> I swear to god he's actually a good guy. It just scared the crap out of me. Doesn't it when... Oh, I, I was going to nearly spoil it then. Don't spoil it! <laughs> you remember what we said about no spoilers? No, I won't spoil it. Oh god. Uh, I'd be in her shoes. You, you know you heard what he just said on the TV, that guy. What? I didn't actually realise that he said he's trying to help her. That's what I was gonna say. Ah, oh, no. like, I didn't actually know guy. that. Ah. Maybe, maybe viewers, he was stranded. Like he came, he got stranded on this island, was never able to escape, and he's trying to help her or something. Because she's there, stranded now. That's what I was going to say, and then I was going to say, you know, the later bit, you know. Oh yeah, happened. don't talk about that. Yeah. Hey. We work this through, Lara. Fire and water don't work. <laughs> God, her wound must really hurt. Oh God! But then it gets Imagine having a nail stabbed right in the side of your stomach. It's not very nice. So I doubt you'll ever get lost because, like, you've played this game through fully. No, we haven't played it 100 percent. Like, you have to get like all items and all secrets to do all that. It's a bit like the earlier Tomb Raiders where you'd have to get all, like the dragon secrets and everything to get 100%. But my sister yes. didn't, I'm guessing. Um, I on. did one of the secrets in my gameplay in my first game through, but that was a long time ago. What? A li well, not that long. A little bit. Game. In my first gameplay of this, yeah. I did... Um, I got I got one of the secrets and one of the. Oh, I thought you were talking about like you doing it like a game walkthrough. Oh no 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 no! I really want to do a couple of them for like uh, fun punchy games. The new ten 
It's coming out on HD when it comes out. I'd do a Let's Play of that for sure. It's We're one both of Fantasy fans. <laughs> me more than you are. No, I wouldn't say that. I've played more Final Fantasies than Hmm, I think I think it's a good a good amount for each. I've played a lot of the older ones, I think. Okay, let's run through a cave! <laughs> Laura doesn't run when she's injured and holding a bloody thing. Yeah, that she's been wounded really badly. Like, that's the best that she can do, really. So as you can see, it gets you right to the action to throw away. It's pretty, it's pretty epic. You'll have loads of, like, gameplay footage of this. Oh, God. Oh, which button is it? I can't remember. Oh. Oh. Oh, you have nearly died. <laughs> He's crawling after me! Oh, he got killed by a rock. But there are going to be a lot of scenes like, like within the game where you have to do all this like instant reaction stuff. I like it because it reminds me of Heavy Rain games. Yeah. I love Heavy Rain. The new um, Beyond Two Souls is coming right. out. Oh god! Coming out. <laughs> coming out soon, so I can't wait for that game to come out. Uh oh. Oh, don't die at the beginning. I'll be a bit lame if I did that. That'd be funny. <laughs> Let's climb up here. Get like, isn't it a bit impossible, first. but. Get a butt angle. And we escape the first challenge of the game. 1% complete. <laughs> <laughs> A bit what? bloody though, but... And dirty. I think it's more dirt than blood. Because you just lit in loads of water, so... I would have washed it off. Yeah, when but... I first heard about this game, I thought it was going to be more of a survival game. Which I think they should have added more into, you know, making sure that you have to eat within certain times or you'll die of starvation. They should have added that more into the game. But it's more of an adventure game, because it is Tomb Raider. Yeah, but I all. think they said it was going to be like a survival kind of thing, and it didn't turn out to be like that as much, but... It's still a very, very good game and I recommend it. Very much so. Okay. Also, like Down. saying that I wanted to add is that I potentially might be doing this as a let's play of my own on I've got a solo gaming account which is called It's My Gaming and I'm thinking about it after I've done Yoshi's Island so Have you? I didn't know that. Yeah. Oh, okay. Just doesn't oh. Much in my life. oh, cause you think you can do better than me? No. I just like the game. I just want to do it. <laughs> Challenge number two, cross the tree. Uh, will I fill off or not? Okay. Calm down a minute. Okay. I'm normally really crap at these, but I, I think this game is... Myself. If I was doing this in real life, yeah, I wouldn't be. I'd rather just crawl across it. You'd probably have better luck to crawl across it than your butt. Oh, got over. I haven't died yet, viewers. I probably will die in this game sometime, but... It's kind of inevitable that anyone playing this game will die at least once throughout. As you can... I love, I love the scenery in this game. It's just so awesome. You see all those rip shit. But there's a mystery in this game. It will unfold as we play it. I think this bit, this bit kind of reminds me a little bit of Uncharted. Mm, remember, Uncharted is... Do you remember is... the, was it the train bit where... Oh, yes, the climbing of the bit? train, that's yeah. the best bit in the game. It's like the beginning as well, isn't it? Yes, it's right at the beginning. because you... is, is it? Two. Two is the best one, I think. Third one was really good still, but um, first one I didn't... I think it's the controls are a bit different because they changed the controls in it. But yeah, everyone knows Nathan Drake is like... The, awesomest guy ever in gaming as well as um, uh, his voice actor North Nolan's epic and he's starting a new game called Dev Pulp that's like quite awesome as well the character like an older version of him like oh Nathan Drake doesn't look his age at all I didn't want to fall off the cliff so I had to look round I wonder if you could just jump off the edge. probably and then you'd die go dead 
also something that's very cool is the music as well. Like you know yes, how it's I love got the kind music. of like the theme of like the older ones, but you know change up a little bit, mm. which is really nice. Yes. Some of the remakes of the games aren't aren't a, they're all right, but they're not as good. I think this game, I think if this, when the second one comes out, it'll be amazing. Just wonder what it's going to be about. Sam, they must have come this way. You just wonder that she'll go, uh-huh. <laughs> that was only in 2 minutes 2, wasn't it? I think so. I think 3 she didn't see anything. Can anyone hear me? Mm. I've got to find them. Yeah, for me personally, Tomb Raider 2 is my favourite because it's more memorable uh, to me since I played more of that in my childhood. Oh crap, I fell. <laughs> I oh, no, I, I, oh no, I was supposed to fall. I was an yeah. idiot. Okay, that was a bit of a... Random. I forgot about that bit. What's your favourite? Um, my favourite is Angel of Darkness because it came with PS2 and I like it. They had rom a, a romantic a side to it. A lot of people would disagree with you probably. But. Well, it's their opinion and I like it, so... <laughs> to me, it just doesn't seem like a Tomb Raider game because Tomb Raider isn't a type of like, person that you know talks. She's more of an acting type of girl. It's just, I don't like the setting either. Really. It's your opinion. Mm. She's really clean now. <laughs> bit, bit cleaner. Is anyone listening? Please respond. Our cat is like sitting next to us. Yes. <laughs> we have a cat called Ronya. It's a long story. Don't ask us what her name or why we named her. <laughs> yeah. If you yeah. want to know, you can message me. Or shall I probably eventually say it. Probably in another Let's Play. Another the, yeah. <laughs> the last one. Is it going to make the fire? But you game if it did didn't it be like oh crap oh crap dead next day end the game just there was no fire there's a lot of awesome scenes in this game so I should let you watch I don't even know what my favourite scene is I, I sh we shouldn't talk about it because if you do it we'll spoil it yeah that should be more at the end when we have actually finished the game, then we can talk about scenes, yeah. or near the end, or when they're past. To be like, yeah, that's just my favourite scene. Credits, and then just wrap it up and say. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Here's the soon-to-be world-famous archaeologist Lara Croft in her native habitat. She's on the hunt for the lost kingdom of Yamatai, home to the fabulous Himiko, mythical Sun Queen, and ancestor of yours truly. Sam, this is serious. Oh, sweetie, I know. I'm just trying to lighten the mood here. Everyone's so on edge. What are you so worried about? I'm close to something. I'm sure of it. I just don't know if the others will listen. Or even if they should. Lara, you know this stuff better than anyone. Seriously, I'm not just saying this to make you feel better. I trust you. Roth trusts you. You got this. Now let's take a break, okay? Okay, okay. And Sam, thanks. She's not always this serious, you know? Come on, tackle him! No, no, it's your chance! How can you suggest I'm not serious about this expedition, Laura? It's not just Sam's family funding us. I put my savings on the line, too. We've all got some kind of stake in this. The funding won't last forever, Whitman. That's precisely why we should push east, not west. No one believes Yamatai... No one believes Yamata is that far east. The books simply don't support it. Well, whoever wrote those books never found Yamatai. I've talked to Roth about this. There's no point in following in other people's footsteps, Dr. Whitman. I refuse to bet my reputation on your hunch 
I'm the lead archaeologist here. And when were you last in the field with a TV crew behind you? Got 30 years' experience, two PhDs, one in East Asian history. So why don't you just stick to boats, Mr. Grimm? Ship, Dr. Whitman. It's a ship. You don't need a PhD to know Look, that. Going east will take us directly into the Dragon's Triangle. That's where we need to go. Lara, my little bird. I'd follow you almost anywhere, but that place has a bad energy. Bad storms, more like, makes the Bermuda Triangle look like Disney World. <laughs> Sign me up. The stories about Queen Himiko say she could summon storms. Myths are usually based on some version of the truth. What if Yamatai was somewhere in the Triangle itself? Well, look, this is the satellite imagery from inside the Dragon's Triangle. That doesn't look good. If it's wet, I can sail on it. Oh, don't tell me you're seriously Enough. cons... Reyes is right. We don't have the funds to piss about. It's now or never. Lara's offering fresh ideas and a plan. I'm the captain here. It's my decision. We're going into the Dragon's Triangle. Why am I even here? <laughs> Sorry, if you hear your repetitive... Didn't do my... Oh, you just showed in the cutscene. Oh, shish. And that's the end of part one. I will see you in part two. As the time is nearly over. So <laughs> hope you enjoyed. And see it. come back for part two. Bye. Bye.